Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you about Castric Wabalas Limiting. Castric Wabalas is a stressing of all or part of so much on its axis by at least 180. Organoaxial Wabalas, A O A V, rotation along long axis. Mesentero axial wobulus, arm AV, rotation along short axis. 58% present within Persia line. Acute chronic or acute on chronic symptom include retching, non balas hemesis, pain, and distension. Respiratory distress and sinusis may be seen actually. Failure to rise and colic and or seen chronic colic. Hematemesis in late stage occurs secondary to ischemia. Complete bochartite is uncommon. Unproductive retching, epicastic extension, inability to pass and tissue. Retrographic finding, brown, must be studied, discussed under and or about left hemidiaphragm that is compressed with nasal constriction. Upright imaging, nasal to air free level. Upper GI with its contrast and hand, CG to confirm diagnosis. ORV, horizontal stomach with pylorus directed inherently, greater curvature superior to less curvature. LAV, vertical stomach with pylorus superior to pandas. Pylorus lie close to or overlap castor vesicular junction. Left side down, a copious radiograph of the six months old patient with vomiting so to large air filler in the left lower hemidurac and left upper quadrant of the abdomen, respectively. Upper GI in the same patient, so a stomach lying. Largely in the left hemograph, the stomach is inverted in the with the atrium and castric outlet lie about the pondus. Note the twisting of rugal hole in the carrier. And I should mesentero axial wobblers was found at surgery with a chronic diaphragmatic hernia. AP radiograph in a four months old with abdominal distension and decreased PO intact intake, so the stomach should be markedly distended and rounded. And all kind of axial castric aulas was found at surgery. Contrast in hand CT in an 11 years old with vomit thing so a narrow pylorus about the level of the cast stroke esophageal junction. The proximal node node is stretched. The abdominal content extends abnormally into the lower left hemodura. A messenger of axial gastric wobbles was found at surgery. Supine AP radiograph of the abdomen in a six-month-old patient with vomiting so an abnormally large and rounded 
loosen C in the black upper quadrant. There is not a typical apparent for class in the supine stomach. An abnormal density is also known over the left lower hemidola. A mesenteral axial gastric volvulus with left diaphragmatic hernia was found at surgery. <laughs> Frontal upper GI image so an abnormal inverted configuration of the stomach with the pylorus anomaly high in the left upper quadrant type called of a mason zero axial gastric wobblers node the associated abnormal left hemi diaphragm. AP radiograph in a newborn so round the latest so much in the midline about the diaphragm, consistent with the hernia and superimposed gastric wobblers. Treatment. The research state is required in 23 to 60% of acute presentation. Gastric decompression with anti-tissue, open or laparoscopic reduction, Gastrofixy and or gastrostomy should repair of associated defect with secondary and secondary wobblers. Controversial if gastrofixy is required after repair of associated anomaly. Non operative treatment of chronic wobblers is more common outside North America. Gastric decompression. Feeding prone or right side down with head elevated about social. Plus minus A2 blocker and metal chlorpromide to enhance esophageal or and gastric emptying. Thank you.